with all the trouble that Joe Biden's had the last three weeks with Afghanistan, Donald Trump has been lurking. Now, I use the word lurking um, in, in not a precise way. Hovering, lurking, trying to figure out how to exploit the problems Mr. Biden is having. So we got a hold of the first video component to this. Go. Afghanistan cannot be used as a terrorist base. That Afghanistan has become the Disneyland for terrorists. We plan for every contingency. Total chaos. It is heartbreaking. It is depressing. It's a failure. And he needs to own that failure. Very responsibility for all that's happened. He did not admit any mistakes. He did not uh, offer any change, of course. He says we're going to continue forward. He really isn't taking responsibility. Mr. Biden, you did this. You made the deal with the Taliban. This is the consequences of it. Go for hell, Biden. Tens of thousands of people are being left behind. There's American citizens left. We're going to stay to get them all out. We did not get everybody out. Dozens and dozens of U.S. citizens went to the airport, and the gates never opened. The mission hasn't failed yet. If this isn't failure, <laughs> what does failure look like exactly? But uh, there's, you know, there to be... All right, so that's a devastating one minute, four seconds. The ad was paid for by the Save America PAC organization. So President uh, Trump wants to run again. I told you that. He told me. Um, And so he set up a bunch of political action committees. They raise money. That money doesn't go directly to Donald Trump, but he controls the money. So that ad that you saw there is not going to run on the network news. You're not going to see it there. You'll see it all over the Internet and um, perhaps um, Fox News Channel and uh, the other um, conservative organizations, ONN and Newsmax, perhaps. But it's pretty devastating. And um, this situation is hurting not only Joe Biden, but the Democratic Party and all the people who run the Democratic Party and who are working with Mr. Biden know it. They know that this is a catastrophe for them, not just for the people left behind in Afghanistan. 